Chris, a franchise best tenth consecutive victory. What have you learned most about this group during that stretch? Uh, we just found ways to win games, and whether that's been good goaltending, special teams, power play, penalty kill, um, you know, third, fourth, first line, everybody's contributed. It so. You don't put a streak together with um, just relying on one line or a few guys. So uh, I'm very happy that we were able to do it. And some high-scoring games, some low-scoring games, but uh, yeah, finding ways. This week in particular, you've won three consecutive one-goal hockey games. How do you describe the character and the grit in that dressing room right now? Well, when you're winning games, it's you have confidence. You don't have to, um, you know, doubt yourself and feel that you need to change your game I think there's been confidence of we'll just stick with it we'll win a, win a hockey game and you know I've been very happy with our guys we've been doing that and we've been talking about doing playing that way for a couple months and I, we go back to that game against Winnipeg where we thought we played really well and we stuck with it and we end up getting a break and end up winning that game but um, just stuff like that and it's not always going to go your way the other teams are going to have pushes um, and um, we just got to make sure that we stay composed. you probably they have uh, the records that when you're in Edmonton order in 2024 and you're trying to chase a record some of them are just so unattainable like you're never going to get Gretzky's points you're probably not winning five cups in the next few years maybe you will but to get a record to do something that that group never did is that you know can you put that in perspective um, yeah, I think when it's all done, maybe we'll sit back and enjoy it a little bit more. I think it feels good right now. I think what feels really good is we're moving up the standings and looking for the playoffs and trying to build for a long, successful playoff season. Um, yeah, right now it feels really good. I think down the road, maybe when the season's done, it'll feel even better that we, we accomplished something that a lot of good hockey teams didn't do before, which... Um, but uh, right now, I don't know. I, I just like our focus on what we need to do tomorrow. Are you uh, looking at the scoreboards and then seeing who's uh, close by and who's attainable, and are the players focusing on that we as well? We look at the standings, but it's there's so many games left, and um, that's one of the things that we we talked about when I first got here. Let's not look at the standings and let's break the season up in small segments because we look at where we are right now. It's, it looks like. It's too unattainable. It's too hard to over or, uh, overcome the hole that we're in, and um, just take it uh, one game at a time. Ten games at a time look pretty good. <laughs> right now, it's looking good. Hopefully, it's eleven.